What's going on people? I'd like to welcome y'all to another One Take Review. This is a review of My Hero Academia episode 27, Grand Torino, bizarre Grand Torino appears. Uh, now, I'm pretty sure this is a shonen anime, so we all figured this would be coming sooner or later, that one old guy who's obsessively and super damn strong for no apparent reason. But then again, they actually do give him reasons, but it, like I said, it's just that old guy who's strong as hell, who's smart as hell, who can teach you something, and when you learn from him, you also get, gonna get strong. And plus, he was, uh, he was an all mice teacher or a homeroom teacher for a year. Uh, we don't know what happened to him after that. Uh, that that's the that's the thing. So we, we, I'm kind of wondering like why was it only a year? Uh, but yeah, he trained all my because uh, something happened to the seventh person who had all my all my was the eighth and uh, uh, Deku is number nine to, you know, inherit all might. So, I I, re I kind of want to know, like, because uh, Grant Torno said, like, he haven't told him about the seven. And I, I really want to know uh, what was going on with that. But anyway, this episode was, uh, episode was pretty good. You get a, a less China sequence, and, and, and you know, the Grant Torno's wise and smart, and he knows how everything going to go. First, you know, to start the episode off, him laying on the ground, he seems like this, like, this, like, gag character, but you know it's more to him than that, because, you know, let's be honest, All Might was scared of shit of him when he was thinking about it. Uh, one thing I want to, I want, I was wondering about, though, like, why in his flashbacks was he taller? I guess when he got older, he shrunk. Or can he get taller? Maybe? Because I'm just looking at the, the, the flashbacks, and the flashbacks, he's about the same height as All Might. Now he's short as hell, so did he shrink? Maybe. Anyway, yeah, Deku was not taking him serious, and then the guy starts jumping around the damn place like a, like a damn like toad off X Men. Like I'm wondering, like, with super speed or some shit. Uh, it's toad mixed with um, uh, Eater's power, so it's, that motherfucker just going around everywhere. But I think he has like air under his uh, under his shoes to boost him uh, the speed. I think it says something about that. But yeah. So he he Deku couldn't keep up with him in the attacks. Well, he's he ended up attacking him once, and so he kept doing it. Like Deku, like okay, we start now. And you know how his mind works. He always thinking things. I, the, the dude is a, a one thing that I think is one of his best qualities. And by he, I mean uh, Izuku, is that he how, how he thinks during fights and how he quickly come up with strategies and plans. And if it probably would have been somebody else, he probably could have had him. But since this, this, this guy, he understood, like, and and because he told him, like, hit me with all you got. And he's like, I don't think you'll be able to take it. So he dodges his attacks easily, and, and then he puts Deku down, and like, you, you're too stiff. And I, 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 get, I get what he's saying, because, like, every time Deku uses all my, he focuses in one spot. Which ultimately by the end of this episode, he learns, hey, if I use just 5% to put the whole thing through my body, I, you know, it'll give me, you know, I'll be better, you know. And and that for me was like awesome because he goes outside and trains that night trying to 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 transfer from his feet at first or his legs and, and feet and then to his hand. And he kept trying to do it over and over, which he never succeeded. He was up all night uh, doing it. And it was like dope because it's fine ah, when he did ah, all my is just natural like all my just gets big but when midoriya uses all my and and like the lines go through and then that's why yeah like lightning or on i'm like Shit. this guy he's gonna either be one of the greatest shonen characters we've ever had uh and I, I was so pissed whenever I knew it was about to end, but I thought it, I was watching. I'm thinking, okay, God, they got like five minutes left, so let me see these guys like do a little something. And it went straight off. I was like, what the fuck? I could have swore we had five minutes left in this episode, dog. I could have swore we had five minutes, but you know it is what it is. Got to wait till next week. Uh, is that just that's how they get you? That's how they get you. Uh, but yeah, I'm so excited to see him. 
hopefully he get to learn some stuff. And this is only, only I think normally will be uh, with these interns for like a week or maybe two weeks. I want to say it's just a week though. But at the same time, I still know everybody's about to get stronger. Uh, you see Kachan with his uh, hero. He said he gonna teach him how to you know control himself yet because he has a few of a lot of flaws and he want to get want to help him with that. And if we see a more controlled Kachan. The, the, there's no telling what we're going to get. And we saw uh, Endeavor, uh, Shoto, he finna teach him some crazy stuff. I really want to know what his definition, what uh, Endeavor's definition of a hero is going to be to him because we always seen Endeavor as like a dick. Uh, it's, 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 the dude's always seen like a dick. So, and, and he's a top rank. He's the second uh, hero in the world. Uh, second well, second uh, strongest hero in the world. So we just wondering like, how, because like, what, what, what does a hero define a ten, to him? Because you know, like I said, he always seem like a dick. He, he mistreats his kids. You know, he only use them so he can have so much strong all might. So that's that's another thing we want to see. Then either he's in, uh, I think he's in, well, he's in Tokyo. I want to say he's in Tokyo. He's because he's trying to find Stain. Uh, he want to get revenge on Stain, knowing. Even if his brother can take him out, there's no way Ida has a chance. But I'm pretty sure Ida will meet him and uh, get his ass whooped or, or damn to death before somebody saves him or something. There's no way he'd be staying. And staying, talking with the uh, good guy, I can't think of his name, in the shadow dude. Uh, and he doesn't really want to be a part of that. He don't really care about what they're doing. Mm. He's actually about to attack them. And I, <laughs> I, I want to see how that's going to turn out, you know. I, I really want to see how that's going to turn out too, because Stain like he has his own, he has his own mission. So he he really not down for what them. And he said, I don't even, I, you people people like you I hate the most. So also we seen uh, Ur Uravity. I'm just I'm just use that other name. So Uravity, uh, she's training with uh, Gunface. I think this is his name. Uh, and I I want I'd like. I, I like that combination because it's too it's it's completely opposite of what she usually does. I think she gonna gain some. And we saw my boy uh, Kirishima and uh, Tessa, 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 and they together. So you are gonna get them. Uh, they, they, they could do like a buddy cop movie. I, I mean a buddy cop episode, and I'd be cool with them. Them two guys. Uh, Minetta, she, he's with. Uh, I forgot the lady's name that could turn like real big, but he's over there just cleaning right now. I, I she better let my boy do something. My boy needs to get stronger, man. And I need my boy to do something. I, I can't wait to watch this. I love his uh, voice in the dub, so I, like hearing what he said in the dub. I can't wait to watch it later on when I get home. Uh, uh like the, the girls does creation, uh, and I forgot who she was with, and we also saw uh, earplug. Air Jack, uh, we saw them. Uh, we we didn't see uh, Tokoyomi, so I, I wonder where he's at. And we also didn't see uh, 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 Kishi Kishi Kishimoto. Oh, Kishimoto. I'm thinking. No, I don't know. No, it's not Kishimoto. Uh, what's the name? Who does the electricity? We didn't see him as well. So those two, I think we probably might see them next episode. But yeah, this episode overall good. Uh, I enjoyed it. Let me know what you guys think. Who you think gonna get the best? Who you think best gonna get the most out of their training with their, you know, their internship? You know what I'm saying? Let me know down in the comments. Hit that like button. Subscribe to my channel. Share my videos. Hit the link in my description for all my other social media outlets so we can talk about this outside of YouTube. And I'm out, folks. Till next time. Peace.